Next up we have Dries talking on update on the Drupal Association. Your time starts now. Alrighty. So I didn't prepare because they only just asked me two minutes ago or 15 minutes ago to give a presentation. So I wanted to give you a quick update on the Drupal Association. It's the nonprofit organization behind Drupal, which we organize Drupal cons, we host the websites, all of these things. So I started the Drupal Association back in 2005. And I started it because we had a big server meltdown and I needed to raise money um, to buy a new server. And so I put up a PayPal button, pretty empty page, replaced Ditado with this empty page with a PayPal button. And within 24 hours, people chipped in $10,000 in PayPal. And so I freaked out because I'd never had $10,000. <laughs> and I changed the password of PayPal to be like, this long. <laughs> Anyway, but I also realized that I needed to do something, and so I started the Drupal Association to have a checking account. Uh, fast forward six years, 2011 was a very big year for the Drupal Association, and we've effectively rebooted the Drupal Association, meaning we went from a working board, where the board members actually did all of the work, to a policy board, where we set the tone and the vision and the strategy, and we work with committees to help drive the change. We also hired eight uh, employees, so we now have actual staff to help with fundraising, uh, to help with the website, to help organize events and all of these things. So big, big change. Uh, we moved the Drupal Association from Belgium to the US and we moved the people from New York to Portland. So we now have an office in Portland where we have a bunch of people. Um, so if you wanna get involved with the Drupal Association, there is effectively two ways. One, you can give us money. Um, as individuals, you can give us 22 euros. I don't know how much, you know, um, Australian dollars that may be, but it's not a lot. <laughs> and as organizations, you can give us 72 dollars, uh, euros, sorry. And we'll use that m money to pay for the people, uh, to fund improvements to DDO and so forth. Um, let's see what else. Um, so we just had a meeting in uh, Chicago, and I can keep talking, by the way. <laughs> we just had a big meeting in Chicago with the Drupal Association Board, and we strategized on what we should focus on in 2012, so this year. Um, and we've come up with two big topics. Um, one, we want to fix, and Amy may like this, we, we want to help fix the, um, the talent issue, right? So we're going to do all sorts of initiatives to get students involved in Drupal and all of these things. And secondly, we've decided that we want to make Dodo the Walhalla for developers. So we're going to look at Git, GitHub and you know, places like this and try to, you know, move over some of these ideas into DDO and make another big investment. So please get involved, either give us money or give us some of your time and resources and we can work together and on making DDO the best possible place for all of us to live. So thank you. Next up we have Andrew talking about Asaya.